Hey guys, Dustin here with BSX Athletics. Now that you've received your very own BSX Insight, I wanted to do a quick walkthrough to help you on your first lactate threshold test. The first thing you're going to want to do when you get your device is make sure it's fully charged. When you open the packaging, you'll find your BSX Insight sitting here at the top and your calf compression sleeve here on the left hand side. Underneath you'll find your charging cable, base station, and a quick start guide with important information to help get you started. Once your cradle is plugged into the computer, just set the Insight device in it. It will start blinking blue to indicate that it's charging, and when fully charged, will turn solid blue. While it's charging, you can download the free mobile application from either the App Store or Google Play. Here I'll show you from the App Store. Type in BSX Insight and download. Now that you've downloaded the mobile application, create your account. Afterwards, you're going to be asked to pair your BSX Insight with your phone. To do this, turn on the Bluetooth antenna and simply hit connect. Green check mark means that the connection was successful. Now that you've paired BSX Insight to your mobile phone, you'll be taken to the dashboard. If you have a multi-sport edition, you'll have both a running as well as a cycling dashboard. To navigate between the two, simply tap dashboard at the top and choose your sport. To begin a run assessment, for example, navigate to the running dashboard and hit take run assessment. On this screen, you'll be asked to answer a few questions about yourself to customize the assessment to your fitness level. I want to take a moment here to emphasize the importance of sticking to the recommended protocol. This is science after all, and the better you stick to the recommended stages, the better your results are going to be. That's why we recommend doing the assessment on a trainer or on a treadmill. On the pairing screen, we're going to pair Insight with your a and peripheral devices. For running, this is your heart rate meter, and for cycling, this is your heart rate meter and power meter. To connect, simply hit connect. If for some reason you have trouble connecting, try bringing your peripheral device closer to your Insight. This can sometimes help on initial pairing. Once completed, simply hit Start Assessment. Now that everything's paired, slip Insight into the calf compression sleeve through the large hole on the inside. Then slip the sleeve onto your leg with Insight centered over the widest portion of your muscle. Once you're ready to go, all that you do is hit Start. I'll point out a couple things to you on this screen. One is the timer. This represents the three minute stage that you're currently on. The large number at the bottom represents the pace that you're on and you can switch between pace and speed by tapping the indicator. Here you'll see your heart rate and on the right side here you'll see muscle oxygenation. This value will show 30 seconds into the second stage so at first you'll notice a few dashes but that's fine. It's getting used to your body during this period of time. Fast forward now. Once the test is completed, all that you do is hit the lock button followed by stop to complete the test. After your test is completed, you'll go to the results screen. Here you'll see your lactate threshold pace as well as the training zones. That's all there is to it. For more information, check out the quick start guide that came with your insight or our blog. Thanks for watching. And please remember to share your success stories with us online.